Hey guys, it's Jordan, aka Impulse, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a wallpaper such as this one. First thing you want to do is just create a new project. Insert text. Just call the text whatever you want. Crank the depth on to, up to 150. Choose your font. Today I'm going to be using a font called Mod. You can download it off dofont.com. Um, what you want to do is that. Um, now you want to insert a uh, a plane. Uh, just spam the zeros. Okay, there we go. Now you want to do is just insert a light. Drag the light up. Insert another light. Drag the light over to this side now. Just drag it up again. Okay, now you want to make a new material. Go to color. Just create like a matte black kind of. Okay, there we go. Now just drag this on. Now what you want to do is go down to the tag selection C1, all uppercase. That should highlight just the front, as you can see, and leave the back texture default. Okay, now you want to make another material. Go to color, go to texture, gradient, click on gradient. 2D V. Now select your first color. I'm going to be using a blue, and the second color is going to be a green. Okay, now we've done that. Go here, go to texture, copy channel, I go to luminance, tick luminance, and paste channel. We go. Now you can add a reflection as well. Just drag the reflection, the brightness down to zero. And texture add a for now. Also drag that down to about 30. Okay. Now just drag this on, and then put it for the black. Okay. Now what you want to do is go to render, render settings. Uh, just load your preset for the save and stuff. Now what you want to do is add an ambient. You go to effect, ambient occlusion. Okay. Now what you want once you've added an ambient occlusion, you want to crank the maximum ray length to 150 and the contrast to 40. Once you've done that, just hey, hey, sorry, I need to change this to, so it'll be a faster render. Okay. You go to render select your preset and render it out. As you can probably set, tell already this is going to be a much longer render because it was um, detecting all the shadows and whatnot but it will be all worth it in the end because it looks really nice and has a really nice shadow on it. And there you have it. As you can see, it's a very pleasant scene to look at and is all around a good wallpaper. I hope you like it. Comment, rate, subscribe, and check out our new website at impulsehd.tk. Thank you, guys.